तो वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास प्लस टू सी यस्टरडे वी डिड फॉर्मल इन्विटेशन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ अ प्रिंटेड कार्ड ओके एंड दैट प्रिंटेड कार्ड इज टू बी एड्रेस टू द मास टू मेनी पीपल एट द सेम टाइम इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल फॉर अस टू राइट इंडिविजुअली टू ईच एंड एवरी पर्सन ओके सो सपोज एनी बर्थडे मैरिज एनी एनुअल फंक्शन स्पोर्ट्स डे इज देयर so we get your our cards printed and we distribute accordingly but once we have to invent the content of that card that we did yesterday only fine so today we are going to do formal invitation only uh, but second category it is addressed to one person suppose you are the principal of some school and you want to invite director of some school or any dignitary personality to be the chief guest of your function or you want to invite a notable personality to be the judge or jury members of some competition fine in that case you will not give a common card to them you have to make one special card that is addressed to that person only which should mention the name of that person as well otherwise when you receive a card usme aapke names thodi likhe hote hain marriage cards and birthday parties mein but when you are special person like judge or jury members in that way then you will be getting a personalized card fine so that we are going to do and when you get formal invitation to to be addressed to one person then you have to make it in a letter form only okay the way you write a letter formal letter not informal letter okay now these things will vary please be very careful about this thing if sender's address is not mentioned in the statement then you will not invent it okay there is no need to write that but suppose it is mentioned that you are principal of saint xavier school dehradun fine whatever address is given <coughs> sorry <coughs> then your address is mentioned then you have to write that okay date the way it is written <coughs> sorry then receiver's address then we have subject and the salutation clear and after that uh content mentioning occasion date time venue clear your sincerely your name and your designation if you are principal you will write principal okay if you are director you will write director accordingly is that clear if it is not given to you you need not write this thing <coughs> you can <coughs> directly start from the receiver's address okay let me uh, show you one example beta uh, yesterday you have already seen kal aapko dikhai thi na a letter format same hai yes online children please have a look inviting a dignitary as a chief guest for school annual day function address good samaritan school e24 new industrial town faridabad then skip one line write down date fine again skip one line mr pm agnihotri to whom you are addressing his name is to be written here district magistrate his designation to be written in the next line his address to be written in the third line and city to be in the fourth so receiver address will be of four lines okay name of the person designation address and city clear please note down subject invitation for annual day respected sir it is with immense pride that we wish to celebrate our 25th year in the field of education on 25th may 2022 from 10 am in our school auditorium so you firstly uh, told them the occasion that 25th year then you told the day when you are going to celebrate time and when you fine we shall consider it a great honor if you could grace the occasion and preside over the function and hand over the prizes to the achievers you are using formal language here okay soliciting a line in reply 
uh, when you are done with the invitation in the first paragraph, fine. Then you will switch to second paragraph. In second paragraph, only one line will be there that you are expecting a reply from their side. Soliciting a line in reply by email to confirm your gracious presence or your benign presence on this email ID. Fine. Yours faithfully, Principal Good Samaritan School. Jo address sender ka hai, that will be your person, same person will be here. Okay, is that clear to you all? Please have a close look. Now, second one is inviting a person as a judge. Now, let's do it on the board. Fine. Uh, it is already format is written. We will do one example now. Write down the statement. Total 40 is there. This is three offline. Yes. Uh, write down the statement better. You are the principal of. You are the principal of. Everybody please note down the statement. We will do one example. You are the principal of. Sunshine Public School, Dehradun. Sunshine Public School, Dehradun. You wish to invite, you wish to invite Mr. L. K. Jha. You wish to invite Mr. L. Dot K. Dot Jha, J. H. A. Comma. Director Education Board, Dehradun. Director Education Board, Dehradun. To be the chief guest. To be the chief guest. of annual function of your school, annual function of your school, invent a formal invitation for the same, or write or draft, any word can be there, draft a formal invitation for the same. Clear, you know the name of the person to whom to be invited? And you know that you are the principal of Sunshine Public School. So address of the sender is given to us, fine. So we will be mentioning that. Who is the person who's inviting? The principal, receiver's address will be the principal, Sunshine Public School. Dehradun. Then skip one line, write down date. In this way, you will not use any comma, any full stop in between, okay? Then receiver's address, the director. You can also write the name of the person. Education board. You can write that name in the content. Hanji. The director, education board. You can also write the name Mr. LK Jha, the director, education board, Dehradun. Skip one line, subject. In this subject now, what you're going to write? Invitation. Never ever use uh, to invite or inviting. We should avoid in letters as well as here also. Never start a subject with infinitive to. 
समटाइम्स यू राइट ना टू इनवाइट दिस पर्सन नो इनवाइटिंग मिस्टर झा नो इनविटेशन यू यूज दिस वर्ड ओनली इनविटेशन to be the chief guest on annual day so this is your subject invitation to be the chief guest on annual day this is specifically for one person those who have joined now fine to those student i'm telling so we are doing formal invitation only but when we are supposed to address to one person sender address the way we write letter date skip one line receiver address subject now you have to be too respectful towards them respected sir fine so the way you write a letter similarly you will be writing this this is to inform you that you can write that way also you can straight away start from we are hosting Thirtieth annual day, fine. Uh, you can start writing from here, it's left side. Okay, I'm just discussing with you all that we are organizing twenty fifth annual day on first March or thirty first March, twenty twenty two. Fine. at 10 am in the school premises so your first line should be the information of what where when clear all the w's to be answered in the very first line you cannot write ha huh, i am this person in this this is not letter this is the difference okay it should be in the format of a letter but you will not write in letter we firstly introduce ourselves then we tell the reason of writing the letter and all here directly you will be telling that why uh, you are you know writing this invitation so you will write that we are going to organize our 25th annual function on 31st march 2022 fine we solicit your benign presence again you have to be formal because it is formal invitation though it is addressed to one person we solicit or seek if you do not know the spelling of solicit s o l i cit you can also use the word seek we solicit your we request your that is also correct fine we request your gracious presence or benign presence same words we have used yesterday as well fine gracious or benign heavenly is coming here we solicit your we solicit or ya fir likhoge seek or request any word you can use out of these three we solicit your benign presence on this very occasion on this very occasion because already you mentioned the occasion in the last line na on this very occasion to be the chief guest of the day fine full stop kindly give your consent to do the honors okay so you have to ask for the consent also so that if you get a reply only then you will take the things further kindly give your consent to do the honors fine we will be really obliged for the same or you can also give the email id along with that to do the honors on the email id uh, sunshine public school at the rate of gmail.com you just mentioned that this is the email id here you have to give the consent fine or confirm your presence clear uh looking forward you can also write now your thing is done you mentioned occasion date time and you have requested the person also that what he is supposed to do usko ye bhi bata diya purpose is done now you will change the paragraph in one line only you will be writing looking forward for a favorable response okay so looking forward for a 
favorable response it means you want that person to attend that ceremony as the chief guest okay so looking forward for the favorable response yours truly yours sincerely any word you can write here fine yours truly t r u l y do not write e into that okay then your name you can invent any name here name is not given to you fine mr n k gupta principal sunshine public school that will be the subscription okay this is your heading this is your subject this is body of your invitation and then subscription am i clear to you all please tell me yes online children offline walon ko clear hai teenon ko if you get invitation for one person you have see words formal words will remain the same fine solicit seek request gracious benign whether you are drafting a card or you are asking for one person so let's have a look on the screen now <coughs> invitation to judge inter school debate topic likh lo okay that any topic you can get next topic is invitation to judge inter school debate in which sender's address is given date is written receiver address is written and subject me aa jayega invitation to judge inter school debate respected sir saint martins has given the privilege saint martin is the name of the school okay saint martin has been pata kya hota hai sometimes cluster schools are there of cbsc and cbsc chooses one particular school to be the host of competition jaise sahodya ka hota hai aapke schools mein so in that way they are informing that saint martin's school has been given the privilege of hosting the hosting this year an inter school debate competition on 25th february 2022 at 9 am in the school premises theek okay? hai you in, uh, just told the name date uh, occasion everything or you can also write between 9:30 am to 3:30 pm in the school auditorium kindly confirm your availability fine that whether that chief guest is available or not so kindly confirm your availability at the earliest and oblige please send an email to santmartins.school@yahoo.com your sincerely niche aapka name and designation is hod department of english because it is a debate competition that's why humne hod english department likh diya <coughs> again you can have a look of a printed card opening of new showroom fine announces the opening of new showroom at this address on this date time by ritu sharma all are cordially invited 15 percent inaugural dress uh, inaugural discount on all purchases rsvp aline shah you need not draw the picture you can avoid it Please have a look on the statement. जो boards में आए हुए हैं 2016 में. On 30th November, your school is going to hold its annual sports day. You want Mr. Dhanraj Pillai, a noted hockey player, to give away the prizes to the budding sports persons of the school. Write a formal invitation requesting him to grace the occasion. You are Karuna or Karan, sports secretary, Sunrise Global School, Agra. fine even you can make printed card but you can write in the letter format as well the way we have done recently okay i'm just discussing the statements kaise kaise ke aate hain sunrise global school agra is going to organize a one act play competition in the school auditorium one act play competition 
you have decided to invite noted stage artist nalini to grace the occasion draft a formal invitation for her so they have uh, you know the way printed card is made वैसे invite किया हुआ है that is also fine so this is to be sent to the masses again please have a look of the replies now replies वैसे हमने कल करने हैं formal replies पहले करेंगे हम ठीक है formal invitations are done formal replies we will do tomorrow because we are not having much time five minutes are there only clear always remember replies are all uh, also formal as the invitation itself and firstly you have to uh, you know appreciate the host's feelings or host for inviting you you have to thank that person reply ka step kya rehta hai firstly you thank that person for inviting you and second step me uh, you give your confirmation you either accept the invitation or decline fine in formal invitation when you accept it you mention it when you decline you will not tell the reason you will just tell that due to prior engagements but in informal we mention the reason as well fine so that the person can you know make arrangements accordingly agar aapne nahi jana to wo kisi aur ko judgment ke liye bula le fine so we have to give the reply accordingly clear so you have to acknowledge the invitation first by expressing thanks then uh, reply should mention whether you have accepted or refused and reason fine use very specific language use warm language warm means do not uh, you know be very rude you have to be very particular and formal about using the words and it should be brief and specific do remember to include greetings like best wishes in in case you are declining the invitation suppose you are not going to attend the function fine you are replying to them in that case firstly you will thank them for inviting you will tell that you cannot attend it due to prior engagements but thirdly you will also send wishes so marriage uh, for wishes to the couple if it's a birthday wishes to the son or daughter fine any occasion is there so you have to send the greetings as well only these three things to be kept in mind fine and it will again be in a box in 50 words you need not make it centrally aligned reply sirf running paragraphs mein hi hote clear the way we write one paragraph but it will be written in a box only clear to all yes online children please reply is it clear those who are listening those who are just passing the time they will not respond even